right. Hey, boot campers. We're ready for another at-home workout for you. We're going to start out with our, our regular um, stretching routine. Um, if you have weights at home, today it would be great if you had something either um, a single 10-pound weight or something that's around 20 pounds. If you don't, you can grab anything that, um, you know, any item around your house that um, you would be able to do a bottom to overhead lift with. Okay, so if you don't have that, you can go ahead and go grab that now. I'm going to start with our stretches. quad stretch. So grab, feeling that stretch on the front of the thigh. Okay, hip opener. Just easing into these stretches now, easing in. through here, just starting to uh, get the body warmed up. Okay, we're going to go reverse lunge, reverse lunge with a twist. Okay, so just feeling that stretch, top of the thigh. Don't push the range of motion here. Okay, we're still in our warm up. Okay, we're going to take it to the floor. We'll start in our downward facing dog first. So just just a little here, just kind of pressing the heels down, hips up. You can pedal it out. And then take your right foot over your left heel. Press that heel down, pop it up. Get into the view a little bit better. So pressing that heel, and then I'm pushing up on my tiptoes. And then switch it. Okay, so you press the heel and then you push up on your tiptoes. Okay. Okay, we're here on all fours. We're gonna round and arch, working on our thoracic mobility here. Okay, we're going to do some reach throughs. I'm going to just turn so you can see what I'm doing here. So same position to start, and then we're just reaching through with that palm up. Just a brief pause. We do three of these on each side, three. Okay, and then last one. Okay, last one here. We're dropping down. Exhale, bring it back. Three here. Right, 
warm up is done. Um, again, if you have, uh, or maybe I didn't mention this in the beginning, if you have a weight that is somewhere um, between eight and 10 pounds or 20 to 25 pounds, our last exercise today is going to be a floor to overhead lift. So with one hand, it's gonna look like this to overhead, okay? So if you just have like a dumbbell, you can grab the dumbbell on the top and come up and over. Or if you have something a little heavier or even a heavier dumbbell, I have to just be careful about my ceiling. But that's what that last exercise is going to look like. So if you have something, go ahead and grab it. If not, just grab yourself the biggest bottle of whatever you might have at your house. Um, our circuit today is eight exercises. Okay, it'll be eight exercises, so a total of eight minutes. Um, actually, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven exercises, so seven minutes, and then we'll have a little finisher at the end, because who doesn't love a little finisher, okay? So, our first exercise is gonna be on the floor, so I'll let you get down there, and I'm gonna start my uh, timer here in a second, so it's gonna be a plank with toe taps out to the side, okay? Plank with toe taps out to the side. Okay, starting in three, two, one. Here we go. Okay, so it's just a slight toe tap. Good plank form, just a slight. So each foot is just moving out to the side just a little bit, holding that core nice and strong. Breathe, 20 seconds. Less than 10. Three, two, and one. We're gonna stand it up. Bottom half squats. All right, I'm gonna turn to the side so you can see what I mean. We're only doing the bottom half of the squat. Ready, begin. So we go down and we come up halfway. Down, up halfway. If and when you can't hold form for this, okay, just do a full squat, shake the legs out, and go back into it. Good. Breathing. Come on. We're close. Ten seconds. And stop. Okay. Little cardio next. We're going jumping jacks. Okay. Jumping jacks here. Five seconds. Ready? Begin. Fifteen seconds. Good. Feel that heart rate coming up. Hold that good form together. Five, three, two, one. Okay. Next up, we're going push-ups. Remember good form. So I'm going to start with full push-ups and then when I feel my form drop, I'm going to go down to Knee push-ups. Okay, here we go. Ready, begin. seconds. Exhaling 
on the way up. And stop. Okay, split squat. So you can grab that uh, a smaller weight if you'd like, or you can do these without weight. I'm going to use a 10. I'm starting with my right foot forward. So we're doing two of these. Okay, so it's a split squat. You're here and begin. So watch, okay? Just, we're not moving, we're just going through split squat. You're gonna love these, tomorrow especially. Good form now. So, mostly it's that front leg, okay, that's working, that we're engaging. Woo! I was trying to check my time. Lost my balance. 10 seconds. Come on. Go up nice and tall through your upper body. And stop. We're going to switch it. So, left leg will be forward this time. Okay, here we go. Ready? Begin. Feeling that? Come on, getting that that booty nice and strong. Fifteen seconds. Five and stop. Okay, floor to overhead lift. Okay, floor to overhead lift. If you have a low ceiling like me, be careful. Okay, here we go. Ready. Begin. Floor to overhead lift. Good form the whole way. Watch me. See how I'm keeping my back and chest in a good position. Reach it up. If you're doing this with a smaller weight, I'm going to switch so you can see what it would look like. Floor to overhead, come down. You can do this with a dumbbell. Okay, so either one is fine. Floor, overhead, floor, overhead. Come on, one more. Give me a good one. Good, we're going to finish it this round. Run in place. So I lied, it was eight exercises. We're going run in place. 45 seconds, and then you'll get a break. Here we go. Ready, begin. swinging. You have a break following this. You have 20 seconds. Five, three, two, one. Great job. One round down. So we have about 90 seconds in between here, so just catch your breath. I'm gonna grab a little water. Feels good to be moving. If you're joining me live, feels good to get this out of the way in the morning. So we have two more rounds of that. squat just to stretch out and open up my back a little bit. If you didn't 
didn't bring any hydration with you for the workout, go ahead and grab that. <clears throat> you have about 40 seconds. So this next run will be exactly the same, but when we start with the planks, we're going to do, um, instead of toe taps out to the side, we're going to do just little leg lifts. So we're basically coming off the ground like an inch or two. So we're not rotating the hips at all, just coming, coming off the ground just a little bit. Go three deep breaths here. Okay, we're gonna start <clears throat> our second round. In three, two, one, here we go. So plank and then just a slight leg lift. Always holding good form. So if you feel like your plank form is breaking down, just hold a regular plank. If this regular plank is too much, you drop down to your knees. So we're always working at your ability level. Fifteen seconds. And stop. Okay, we're moving into bottom half squats. So you want to make sure you get nice and low. I'm going to use my, my ball as a target, just so you guys can see what I mean. So down, halfway up. Okay, halfway up. Halfway up. Inhale down, exhale up, 20 seconds, these really start to burn, don't they? Oh, yes, you're going to remember me tomorrow and maybe for a couple more days, and stop, okay, jumping jacks. We're going to go seal jumping jacks for this round. So that's just out in front. Ready? Begin. Fifteen seconds. And stop. Push-ups. Coming down for push-ups. Here we go. Ready. Begin. Come on, 15 seconds. Five. Okay. Split squat. So, right leg is forward. Left leg is back. Begin. Twenty 
20 seconds to go. We're exhaling on the way up. And stop, switch it up. Left leg is forward. Ready, begin. Inhale and exhale. Good form now. Come on. Work through the discomfort. Know and listen to your body. And stop. Okay. Floor to overhead lift. Here we go. Ready. Begin. Floor. Overhead. When you bring the weight up and over your head, whether you're doing these with a single arm or both arms, you want those abs engaged. Always want that strong foundation. Five seconds. And stop. Okay. Run in place to finish up our second round. In three, two, one. Here we go. break right ahead of us. Five, three, two, one. Two rounds down, one round to go. Grab your hydration. Shake those legs out a little bit. Remember how um, good this is going to feel to have it up and out of the way. So, one more time through. It's about eight minutes. <clears throat> Let's work through those deep breaths again, okay? We're inhaling and exhaling. Okay, we have about 30 seconds until we start our final round. When we start the plank um, on this one, we'll be in a full plank position and we're gonna go shoulder taps. If you have any wrist problems, you can still do shoulder taps from your elbows. Okay, 
final round. And then I'm sure there'll be a little surprise at the end for you because I know everyone loves a little surprise. Okay, so starting out with those shoulder taps, shoulder taps from a plank position. In three, two, and one. Here we go. Tap it. Tap it. Good plank form always. squats. Here we go. Ready. Begin. Booty back. Halfway. Chest is up. Feet are about hip width apart. And make sure on this that your weight is evenly dispersed, okay, in your feet. You don't want to get up on your tiptoes. Shift it back towards your heels, and that will really help engage your glutes. 10 seconds. And stop. Whew. Did you see me die in there at the end? Yikes. Okay, jumping jacks. Move back to regular, regular jumping jacks on this one. Here we go, ready, dig in. Starting in five seconds. Ready? Begin. Exhaling on the way up. Less than 15 seconds. You are awesome and strong. Five. And stop. Okay. Right leg forward for a split squat. Ready. Begin. Feel this really working your balance. Try to control your breath. Ten seconds. Ten 
and stop. Switching over to the other side. Okay. Get in position. Ready. Begin. fantastic out there. Come on, we're so close to the end of this workout. 10 seconds. Five. And stop. Woo. Okay. Floor to overhead lift. Pick your weight. Ready, begin, floor, overhead lift, floor, always good form, always engaging through your core, with that run in place. Starting in five seconds. Love this now. Come on. Here we go. Ready. Begin. Driving the elbows back. Okay, so we're not trying to be in front. We're trying to drive it back. catch my breath and then I'll tell you what we're doing. Okay, so we're going to stick with the same finisher uh, we did last week, those of you that were with me last week. So we're going five push-ups, bring it up for one squat. Four push-ups, bring it up for two squats. Three push-ups, three squats, until you get down to one and five again. Okay, so five and one, we get to one and five. All right, this will be self-paced. So I'm gonna do it on my time, you guys do it on your time. We're going to start in about 15 seconds, and when you're done, you're done. <clears throat> Give yourself one good deep breath here before we start, okay? Inhale, and exhale, finishing up this workout. We are starting in three, two, one. Everyone's starting with five push-ups. Four push ups. Two squats. One and two. I'm back down for. 
three push-ups. squats. One, two, and three. Come up for four. One, two, three, and four. I think I goofed up my count, so I'm down for one push-up. for five. One.